Hey there everybody, my name is Debbie and I make DIY videos on YouTube. And if you've never visited my channel before, I put together a little montage. So if you like my channel and you like DIY videos, please vote for me. Here's the cliff notes of what I've done. Check it out, see if you like it. I told my dad that I was gonna glitter a chair and he said, it's gonna crack. We're gonna take the hinges off the back of it and the legs are gonna go through it. We're gonna screw them to the plywood and it's gonna go all the way around the mirror. The mirror is gonna be in the middle. We're gonna need E6000. You're probably wondering why it's in a mason jar. You just gotta pull on it really hard. It stinks. We're gonna carve out all of this right here with a knife and they're super cool buoy lights that you found on the beach. They look like I stuck my toes in a big thing of frosting and not eat them. They are toxic. They're not toxic. They're pretty, but they do not taste good. What I really wanted to write on here was Cupid is stupid. We're going to turn this into a bracelet because I'm single on Valentine's Day again. This is what we're making today. It's a starfish chandelier. And then we're going to take off the tape and voila, we'll have a surfboard chalkboard. So thanks for watching our video and subscribe to our channel if you like it and leave us a comment. Let us know if you'd like to see a headboard or a doghouse. When I opened my store, I had a very small budget, so I started looking through the trash for things that I could sell. I wanted to get on TV and show people how to make stuff. I was super shy, so I went to acting classes, and what do you know it, I got over my stage fright. Then I started auditioning, and auditioning, and auditioning, and auditioning. And I spent a lot of time waiting for the phone to ring until I got fed up with waiting. So I went to the Apple store and I learned how to make videos, and that was the beginning of my YouTube channel. And that was when HGTV finally called me. I flew to New York to meet the producers. They told me to keep my lips zipped or I'd be disqualified. And I didn't make the final cuts. So I went to my mom's house and I ate cookies. So when I found out that I didn't make the final cut of Design Star, I logged into my YouTube account and there was a video in my live feed by Corey Vidal. And it was amazing. And it's this miracle story of how he went from being homeless to being featured on the front page of YouTube. After I watched the video, a week later, YouTube announced that for the first time you could nominate yourself. And so I nominated my channel and I asked my subscribers to vote and they voted. It would be a dream come true to be featured on YouTube. Thank you YouTube for selecting me to compete. I hope you like what you see and I would love to have your vote and that's it. I will see you in the next video. I make, <laughs> yeah, I make lots of YouTube videos. <laughs> To laugh, maybe it's been a while, but even try to smile, even try to smile, cause today is only here and then it's tomorrow, there's no point living a life that's full of regret and drowned in sorrow. Surprise! Choices that you've made.